Hey everyone, it's Kai here with another Kaiism. And in the video this week, I wanted to kind of talk about my experience being unplugged. So a couple of days ago, I went to the Apple store to um, get me and my husband's battery repair. And mind you, it was actually the three of us, me, my husband, and my daughter. And, you know, we arrived pretty much soon after the mall opened and we waited for um, well, three hours to get our phones back. So I'm kind of, um, I'm waiting there by myself in a lot of regards because um, as anyone knows with a young child, they don't have much of a patience level. So he was wandering around the mall with her and I'm like hanging out in the Apple store and around the mall with no phone. And um, I didn't want to go anywhere, like walk that far because since I rely on my phone for all my communication, I didn't want to wander away. And in case my husband was, husband was trying to find me, I wasn't there. So I'm just kind of like standing there, no phone, people watching. I have no sense of time either because I don't have my phone. And, and you know, and the same thing with my husband. I mean, um, the Apple store had both of our phones. So we really had no way to communicate with each other. We had no way to pass time. It was just a free for all. Back in the day before smartphones, I don't even know what we did. I mean, how did we communicate? I mean, I guess we had to either wait with our parents or wait by the phone and have voicemail or whatever. I mean, or I, I you know, it's just crazy because we've gotten so accustomed well, okay, I've gotten so accustomed to having everything at my fingertips that to be without it was just strange. But at the end of the day, I'm really glad that I had that short-term experience because it is going to happen sometimes that I'm going to be in a place where my phone won't work because I won't have signal, I may not have battery, I may be in another country where, you know, Wi-Fi is not as readily available and, um, you know, costs minutes and money to talk to other people. So it was a good experience. And I recommend that, that everybody takes this opportunity to be unplugged because it brings you back to those days when our phones weren't so handy and weren't the end all be all of our lives. Be bold, be brave always. We all have phobias. And with the be bold hyphen be brave dot com website, my affiliate sites are strictly geared towards phobias, things like fear of flying, of social anxiety, and there are more to come. So go ahead and check out those affiliate sites for some help on getting over your phobias. Hey, it's Kai here. If you have five minutes in your day, even less than five minutes, don't forget to click subscribe. And you can also see more of my videos back to back to back by clicking to see more. Be bold hyphen be brave dot com. Always.